Hey all, it's Chris from AdminJS here. Uh, it's been a week since the last product update and I wanted to share with you something that we worked on recently. Uh, in the past week, we worked on AdminJS features, which are basically the pieces of functionalities and pieces of code that you can use in your, in your, in your dashboards right away. Uh, let's, jump on, let's jump on to the documentation. So if, when you can, if you can see, uh, there is a new section in the documentation in the basics, uh, in the basics part, where we've added the documentation for the features, uh, which currently are three, uh, three main uh, features, three main, three main sections here. That is logger, import and export, and passwords. Basically, features are uh, the pieces of the pieces of the code or pieces of the of the functionality that you can add up to your dashboard in one line using one line of code and for logger that is the functionality to log all of the actions that happens in the dashboard and all of the actions that are done on the uh, on the databases uh, import and export basically is the is the feature that will allow you to import and export file uh, export uh, data from the database in a CSV, JSON, or XML format. While well, passwords is kind of a helper feature for uh, password hashing and storing uh, for the authentication uh, for the role-based access control. Uh, let's jump on the code. Uh, let's jump to the code, and I will show you how to use the simplest feature here, which is import export. All of them and everything here is de described and documented well in the in, in our documentation in our docs. So. Uh, First of all, let's go to let's go here, uh, or let's go to the code. I do have a very simple application using admin.js, which have only uh, one, yeah, only one resource uh, that is the dev resource. I do use Prisma for that, uh, for that, and Express as a as a backend. So we do have a dev resource. Nothing special happens in here. Uh, let's. Add our feature to the application. Uh, I'll use yarn add uh, at adminjs import export, and as you can see, the package is installed in my application now. So uh, to use import export feature, what we want to do is we actually want to import uh, import export feature and add the features section and the uh, add the features section in the resource that we have and we're only going to have one uh, one feature for for this resource but one resource can have many features and many features can be used here uh, we used import export feature here as you can see uh, let's run our documentation. Uh, let's run our application and let's see what is going on. All right, uh, we do have an app. I should have it opened here. Exactly. Let's refresh. Let's go to the dev resource. As you can see, uh, we do have two very small uh, patterns over there, which says export or import. I want to export my uh, dev records to the CSV file, so I'll click export download the CSV file and to just to show you how it works I open the CSV file and here it is uh, here's my record from the database uh, so that's it as mentioned before uh, everything's documented well in the documentation as you can see the import export uh, feature is just a couple of lines and go on play with it and waiting for your for your toss and for your opinions